sit yourself down there. I think the microphone's not dropped down the back of the sofa, has it, again? Uh, Connor, I think that was the warmest welcome we've had of the evening so far. Thank you. And rightly so as well, you're feeling at home. Um, and I guess lots of people probably don't realise as well, Connor, just how much of a, an effort it was for you last year. How are you feeling this year, physically and, and mentally, going to TT? I feel fantastic this year. I think last year was... Uh, yeah, it was a bit of a, a, an awkward experience, really. Um, not having to ride a superbike at uh, 100% is hard enough. Um, but uh, broken wrist was a bit of a, a bit of a challenge. <laughs> One I'd rather forget now. Um, but yeah, you just get on with it, don't you? You know, little hurdles come your way. You just have to get over the best you can. And thankfully, I've got long legs, so. Everyone's had a bit of a head start on you this year. They've been to Spain or the UK or even Donington yesterday, but you've not turned a wheel yet. Um, yeah, there's no warm weather testing that's uh, took place, but you know I've had a burn around Jerby on a, on a little stocker that uh, Clive put together for me. And uh, I've been doing a bit of supermoto, so I've been keeping my hand in. Um, I was having a ride around with Davey actually not so long ago, Davey Todd, newcomer. So uh, I've been doing a little bit, but not, uh, you know, unfortunately the team I'm just haven't got the budget to, to go off to sunny climates and you know do the, the hot testing which everyone seems to be doing but we are all right I'm not worried about it you're underdogs really aren't you the Padgett's team the fact that your machinery is so old compared to everyone else getting new machinery but does that kind of work in your favor a little bit do you think yeah we like a challenge I, I certainly like a challenge um, but you know the pedigrees there with, with, the, with, with the team um, I just know I'm, I'm f I fully believe in anything that the team tell me um, and provide me, you know, for, for the teams, I mean, crikey, I think they've beaten Valentino Rossi in, in championship rounds and Grand Prix before, so, you know, there's no question, they know what they're doing, so I'm just so confident in, in my team, uh, so confident in my bikes and myself this year, you know, um, my confidence took a real, a real boost, um, so I'm looking forward to it. Um, and we'll just see what it brings. And just the other thing as well I want to mention briefly is the fact that everyone kind of disses you as a super sport rider, but you've had so much success in recent years on the 600. Yeah, we've had some good results. And again, I've done my best lap with Padgett's, uh, the Padgett 600 Honda, uh, the 26.7, um, which, yeah, people do write me off and, you know, uh, don't write me off, <laughs> basically. Um, I'll, I'll give it my best shot on the day and, uh, yeah, just don't write me off um, in all classes. You know, I've been on the podium here in Super Twin as well, so that's even smaller than a 600. So, yeah, I think um, whatever, whatever, the, whatever is there to, for me to ride on the day, I'll just I'll drive the wheels off as best I can. Um, yeah, that's all I can say. Oh, it's good to hear that you're feeling so home at the team. You're certainly at home here, right? You're quite literally, uh, Connor, and I'm sure everybody here, a bit like Dan Neen, two guys to support very much for the, for the home crowd in this year's TT. Wish you all the best. Connor Cummins. Thank you.